Death on Silver Blade. Okay, this week in the newsletter, um, the biggest news, and uh, congratulations to the team on this. Zero, zero. 400 Circuit Python compatible boards. More than half. More than half. 400. Nothing to do with Adafruit. No, most of them are not Adafruit boards. Actually, so search, let me type in Adafruit. I actually don't know the answer, but type in Adafruit or filter. Yeah. For made by Adafruit. So one of the things that, yeah, you can you can see this here. So. Just, just click that. Okay, yeah. so then and we have to press the X over here. Okay. 88. So less than a quarter of the boards here are Adafruit yeah. boards. So that Most means, are not ours. So that means that there's companies, people, um, open source projects, all are using CircuitPython as the firmware that runs on their device. Every single time there's a CircuitPython update, automatically they get it for their board. And uh, there's 400 total, or there's more than 400. 488 are from Adafruit. Wait, 410. Wow, a bunch just came in. Yeah, and so these are the most popular or the newest ones, but let's take a look at filters. Let's those are actually, Sorry, those are the most... Uh, Downloaded? Down, downloads. You want to sort by newest first. Yeah. Okay. So the most Wait, downloaded so, right now are Picos, Pico. Mini Sam. Although I'll say this is not. What, it depends on the release, yeah. so it's a little confusing. So here's do, yeah. Let, do let's like do date. let's do the newest ones yeah. that just came in. So the newest ones that just came in, you can look at the RP twenty forty LCD. Some there's Pico's. a feather. Here's some new ones. So when you Valbor. Yeah. There, when there's ones that aren't photos, that means they didn't. The information isn't up there yet, but yeah. they're get they're working on it. Uh, Lily Gold, Pimeroni. More Pimeroni stuff, uh, lots of Pimeroni stuff, actually. Um, a M5 stick, a watch. Um, there's a lot going on here. and A lot of TTGO stuff. A lot of, like, random ESP32, S3, and S2 boards. And that's cool. Yeah, like, yeah. load them up. Uh, Sidelights uh, submitted a bunch of boards for their EFR32. They ported CircuitPython. Um, Look at this look like they did menagerie of boards. And a lot of I remember when we had five club. What's that? Wait, hold on. What's that? The Hap Club Sprig. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. What's this? This is a neat way to look at hardware too. I've never even heard of this thing. Yeah. So um, this looks cool. You it's can really get the cool. nightly builds for this stuff. You can get the UF two. Uh, one of the things that we we wanted to do was have a way for people to get the latest firmware for their hardware. That was the hardest thing. And there was like all sorts of websites that tried to do it, or like lists, and there's a zip file. Nearly impossible. We think we we think we've solved this. Um, and then for the um, folks who like to see charts, this is what it looks like over time. Um, I'll disappear us here. Mm -hmm. But uh, from January first of two thousand eighteen all the way up to January first of twenty twenty three. That's a nice that's a nice chart, right? It's oh yeah, we did the math because it was about it's been about a hundred years since we did our last. You know, every one hundred we do an announcement, and so um, it's been. Let's see. From now to the last one was one, basically a year, and uh, it's two boards um, a week on average. Yeah, that's great. So keep on going, and yeah. thank you everyone in the community who's doing stuff with CircuitPython, using it in their hardware, and uh, making electronics way too easy. So other things in the newsletter we posted up that SuperCon 2023 is coming. Yeah. Uh, so Hackaday is putting that on with Supply Frame. Um, you can check out tons and tons of projects if you wanted to get MicroPython working with AWS. That's there. Um, this is kind of neat. This is an RP2040 to open Tesla uh, charging port. Yeah, and it's like you like you use um, you read what the um, code is for your car, and then you can like you know re yeah. replay it. Then we have um, some joystick stuff. We're going to show that in the top secret section, and then just like the entire menagerie of projects that are kind of unending um, every single week. Yeah. And does an amazing job with the yeah. newsletter. Please, please, please consider subscribing. It's over on Adafruit Daily. We don't spam. Um, delivers to your inbox every single week. Get it on Adafruit Daily. We have other newsletters, but this is one of our more popular ones. So check it out.